Well, I drove up from Linwood to uh, East Tallis. I'm here at Tallis Point State Park. And uh, the whole way up, you know, you go east for a long ways on 23. Until you get over the water, and there's a lot of open water. And uh, probably between here and Linwood, which was maybe 30 miles, uh, it wasn't all that far offshore. Uh, it's a beautiful day here today. Sunny, cold, but it's not really very windy. Wind's coming right out of the west. You see these big pressure ridges out here that are just absolutely gorgeous. And if you look out here, on the other side of these big uh, piles of ice, you'll see a lot of open water, which is interesting. They're talking about this record ice coverage of the Great Lakes, and I'm kind of surprised that, that much of it's open with the percentage they're claiming is covered over. So maybe this is just the small part that isn't frozen solid. Up here it's much different. You can see there's no way you're going out in the ice 9 to 11 miles to ice fish. Uh, you'd be in the old drink. So I'm going to check this area out a little bit. Usually I walk to the point, but I'm going to show you the depth charts later too on Saginaw Bay. And uh, you know, right there at Saginaw Bay, Lake Huron down near Linwood, I think. I'll clarify that when I get home. And up here, this is just Lake Huron. We're right here in uh, East Taos. And I'll show you the depth charge because it's just still a big mystery on why it's open some places and why it's frozen over others. It's, it's a weird combination of things, but be back in a few. Now I'm only out about 10 feet off the beach. What a thrill seeker, huh? And as you can see, this water is only about 2 feet deep. It looks like this is, uh, ice is probably 18 inches thick. And you can see the bottom here. It looks like it's frozen right to the bottom. Maybe it's not, but it's close. Most of the time there's snow covering this ice, but man, is it beautiful. See that big crack? I'd say that's probably 18 inches, 12 inches. It's super thick ice. A lot of pressure cracks. Walk out here. This ice is slippery in hell. There's no snow on it. Look at here. <laughs> that's got to be like, yeah, at least, no, it's not frozen to the bottom. But maybe 18 inches of ice. You can see the, see right down to the bottom. That's the sand. This is just so damn super beautiful. So I'm going to be taking some more video. God, this is fantastic. I wish you guys could see this. Hope you like looking at this. Maybe I am crazy. Nobody else is ever out here. God, to me, this is just fantastic. See, now here, we're all within maybe a hundred foot area. The ice is like, went from about 18 inches thick in similar depths. You can see right down to the bottom of the sand. And you can see here, uh, not very far away. And this ice is maybe uh, four inches, six inches thick. And it's all the similar depth. So, just kind of interesting. That's right at the bottom of the sandy beach. Tallis Point State Park, East Tallis, Michigan. Today is just absolutely fantastic. I'm gonna keep walking around here and taking pictures of this ice. See right down to the bottom. So beautiful. Look at this. Now here's about another three miles from where I was. Solid ice again. Can't even see any open water from here. About four and a half miles uh, south of uh, Oscoda. I'm about three miles northeast of uh, Taos Point State Park, and it's all open water. No ice at all.